Hey, it's Sean from Journey Alberta. Today I'm out in Fish Creek Park with my friend Jesse. We're gonna cook up some food over the fire here and then explore this section of Fish Creek Park. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> I've got my hot dogs all ready to eat. I think they should be pretty good. I've never used these buns before. Got them from the local grocery store near my house. Thought I'd try them out, so here we go. Excellent, excellent hot dog buns. I believe they are Villaggio Toscana. Extra soft sausage buns. They're really good. <clears throat> it's pretty good. We finished eating our hot dogs and now we're gonna cook up some marshmallows over the fire because like I've said in many videos before you can't have a fire without marshmallows. You can see that marshmallow there. That is a perfect marshmallow. I don't like to brag, but I am the king of cooking marshmallows. And this one, another crowning achievement for me, marshmallow king. Now, if you were out in the wilderness alone and all you had was a little ax or a knife like this, and you found a little branch like, well, this is not a little branch, this is a big branch, but you could actually carve this to a makeshift spear to do some kind of basic hunting with maybe some kind of small birds if you can find them. Another handy tip if you're out in the bush and all you have is a little knife or something because you can just make the axe like this you don't have to waste your knife doing other things. That's the finished result of my stick carving. Okay, I'm gonna throw this, my makeshift spear, right down this little path here into the trees and see how far I can kinda throw it that way. So here we go. We've started exploring this area of Fish Creek now that we put our food away. We made sure that our fire was extinguished all the way before we started heading into the forest here. It's always important to do. Actually, we're coming to Fish Creek right now, like the water Fish Creek. This should be pretty cool.
All right, so as we've been walking around, I found something that would really help you start a fire if you were lost in like the mountains or wooded areas around Calgary or anywhere that's really wooded. This kind of bark right here that you can see, it's great for starting fires because it's usually been dried out by the sun. You can usually take a little bit off of the trees, but right where I am right here, there's tons of bark just laying around everywhere and it's great to use to get a fire started. Jesse and I have had a great time out here today in Fish Creek Park, roasting some hot dogs over the fire and marshmallows. Oh. And it's been, I think Jesse hurt himself back there. It's also been great wandering around this forested area, running in around the little deer trails and stuff. And Jesse's talking to himself back there. But it's been great to come out here and experience this area. I've never been in this specific section of Fish Creek. I can't remember what it's called offhand. It will say right there on the screen what it's called. It's been really great to come on here today. Hopefully you've enjoyed watching.